hope. That's a commonly used word around here. I hope my football team wins the Super Bowl. I hope Johnny asked me to prom. I hope it snows today so I don't have to go to school. I hope I get that job. I get that raise. I pass the test. I score the winning point. I get the car. I don't have to kiss Ann Hilga at Thanksgiving. More seriously, I hope my friend gets better. I hope I do something great with my life. I hope one day there's world peace. Hope. We say it and we hear it all the time. And I don't want to trivialize it or disregard the aforementioned. But honestly, those are temporary things and they're uncertain at best. It's not that they aren't real or that they're wrong. But let's be honest. If your team doesn't win, Johnny doesn't ask you to prom. If it doesn't snow, you don't get that job or the raise or pass the test. If you don't get the car and Ann Hilga happens to smack a big wet one on you, you're going to get through it. And even if your friend doesn't get better, you don't do something great with your life. And even, even if there's never world peace, all of the outcomes are uncertain. And whether they happen or not, the way you want doesn't really change much in the grand scheme of things because it's all temporary. In the grand scheme of eternity, temporary hopes seem frivolous. See, hope in all the above scenarios is nothing more than a wish, like crossing your fingers, closing your eyes, and saying out loud, I hope I get that raise, I hope I get that raise, I hope I get that raise, is actually going to make a difference. I mean, you don't know what's actually going to happen at all, right? Yet we wish. We click our ruby heels together, we rub the rabbit's foot and avoid walking under ladders and all that, and we slowly open our eyes to see if the wish came true. Well, let me make a quick distinction. There are things we all hope for in the wishing sense, and then there are things we place our hope in. So, can we really call uncertain, confidence-lacking, rolling the dice, closing your eyes, ruby-clicking, rabbit-foot-rubbing, wishful-thinking hope? Is that what hope is all about? And can we really place our hope in looks, or fame, or money, or power? Shouldn't true hope, ultimate hope, eternal hope be based on truth, facts, something more than a wish, something I can know, be certain of, be confident in? I mean, if that kind of hope exists, then it can change us, encourage us, remove fear, relieve doubt, give us strength and get us through anything, give meaning and purpose to everybody, help us love more, understand more, forgive more, accept more, and it can inspire us to share the source of said hope to anybody and everybody. If that kind of hope exists, it changes everything. So does it exist? Yes, and I'll be blunt. It's only found in Jesus Christ because he is the way, the hope, and the life. All other hope is temporary, uncertain, wishful thinking at best. Oh, come on. What if I hope that every little thing's going to be all right? Or we all just become non-existent when we die? Or that I'll get to heaven because I, I lived a good life? Well, rub the rabbit's foot and roll the dice, Jimmy. Those are uncertain wishes based on flimsy guesses. 1 Timothy 2.5.6 declares, There is one God, and there is one mediator between God and men, the man Christ Jesus, who gave himself as a ransom for all. John 3.6. 16 states, whoever believes in him, that is Jesus, should not perish but have everlasting life, which is why Paul confidently wrote in Ephesians 1, 18 and 19, you may know what is the hope to which he has called you. Without Christ, we are still dead in our trespasses and separated from God, which makes us godless and wicked. And Job chapter 27 verse 8 says, for what is the hope of the godless when God cuts him off, when God takes away his life? Without Christ, there is no real hope, period. So do me a favor and finish this sentence. I place all my hope in blank. If Jesus isn't in that blank, you have no hope. That pretty much covers it, folks, and I think we can safely say that this thought, this concept, this idea that you can have true hope without God has been debunked. Adios.